A pristine remote island could be a local filmmaker's dream. For the past half a century, Isle Royal National Park has been the site of wolf and moose research. In tonight's Northwoods Adventure, Fox 21's Melissa Ganji sits down with the filmmaker of Fortunate Wilderness. I've always loved the natural world, and I've always loved taking pictures. And I thought, you know, it would be a great marriage to take Isle Royal and my passion for photography and create a film. After four years of gathering footage on what filmmaker George DeSort of Houghton, Michigan says is one of America's last wild places, his documentary, The Wolf and Moose Study of Isle Royal, is complete. The reviews I have, people feeling like they've been to the island now. They know what it's like. People that have been there, it just reinforces their emotions about Isle Royal. Anchored in the northwest waters of Lake Superior, accessible only by boat or seaplane, the isolated location of Isle Royal and its untouched wilderness is an escape for visitors and the backdrop of DeSort's documentary. It's a place less traveled. And you get there and you, can, you, you have to leave everything behind because you're not going home anytime soon and that just takes takes over. The film explores what scientists have been studying for the past 50 years, the interactions of wolves and moose in this primitive wilderness. But it's also about, you know, seeing people who find something that they love to do and then pursue it. And they have that opportunity to take advantage of it and spend their days doing what they love. Wolf biologists Rolf Peterson and John Vucetich played a key role in the film. They've studied these wild animals for decades and took to sort to places on the island he never knew existed. They showed me an appreciation for the island that I didn't have. But by meeting them and being in the woods with them, I learned so much about the island and what it's all about. In the summer, DeSort traveled around the island by kayak with his equipment in dry bags. In the winter, DeSort and the biologists worked in temperatures as low as minus 20 degrees. And so you're constantly, you know, fighting the elements, but you have to love those elements and you have to love weather to work on a film on Isle Royal because it just comes with the territory. Shooting in those conditions was a challenge, but the result, a meaningful documentary that honors the work of scientists as they study the relationship between wolf, moose, and climate. With photojournalist John Thane, I'm Melissa Ganji, Fox 21 News. Wow, it's beautiful. You can see Fortunate Wilderness at 7 o'clock tomorrow night at UMD's Marshall Performing Arts Center. It'll also be shown at 7.30 Saturday night at the Northern Lakes Visitor Center in Ashland. We'll be right back.